guys, Courtney here, and I believe in this box is Ashton Drake Baby number two that I ordered off of eBay. If you guys saw my other video, I received a Grace, but unfortunately she came with um, those uh, blue discolorations that unfortunately never get better. I did wind up contacting the seller who first and foremost did say that, um, that they did have free returns so I could return her, which is good. Um, so I'm waiting to hear back from them because they did tell me that in their mind, I guess, that the bluing was normal and that it was because it was based off a real baby that sometimes tend to have blue spots. Um, to which I did inform them that that was not true. I mean, I guess it's true that some babies do have some deeper coloring, uh, but I did inform him or her of the fact that the bluing is a defect, um, is unfortunately something that has happened to older uh, Ashton Drake dolls and that the bluing would continue to get worse because the bad thing that would happen is if I sent it back and then they relisted the doll and not inform the seller of this defect. And even if somebody received the doll and thought, oh, it looks, you know, fine now, another year from now or two it's just going to get worse the bluing is going to spread it's going to get deeper it's going to get darker and it's going to be very 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 obvious and it really already is obvious one leg is a completely different color than the other leg um the hands are completely different color and one of the eyes looks like like it looked like she had a black eye so it was very prominent and so i really really hope that even when i send her back the seller does the right thing and uh, puts in the description that she does in fact have a defect because as far as I know there's no fixing it um, So anyway, so we're gonna hope that this one does not have a defect too. I believe if she does I might just give up <laughs> Oh, look at you Let's see here. So this is um, This is actually um, Katie So she's actually a, a bit more rare than Charlie is Charlie is the anatomically correct boy, and Katie is the anatomically correct girl. Um, and Emily, let me get Emily over here. I've not come up with a name, a different name with her yet, but she's the welcome home Emily head, face, and I used um, the Charlie slash Katie limbs on her. So this is what Katie has. Now for this little baby, I plan on actually reborning her um, and keeping her like original face, um, not giving her like an Emily face. But let's get her out and let's take a look at her. Oh, she came with an outfit. That's so sweet. All right, so everything actually looks good. Her coloring looks great. Looks even, similar. Um, because yeah, I believe, as far as I know, some of the Ashton Drake babies. Um, didn't have any issues, even those that were made in the same time period and so on, uh, didn't have any bluing. So it's like they're just hit and miss, unfortunately. I'm gonna fix this diaper. I like these old fashioned diapers with the, the tape. Um, but yeah, her coloring looks great. Now I do see here that, like, say, compared her belly compared to her hand, you can see a deeper coloring. So it is possible that she does have a little bit of discoloration but at this point in time uh the fact that it's not like very prominent is a very 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 good sign um, i've had dolls that have had a little tiny bit of discoloration and they never got any worse and there were no issues there so hopefully she'll be the same way because yeah my my plan is to um completely reborn her put on a cloth body but also like keep her original head um i will of course like redo her hair and all that but her hair is actually really nice wow <laughs> most ashen drake dolls their hair is not that great but it's nice and full and very sweet i like it so she also has this little outfit okay she does have a little bit now that i'm feeling around she does have a little bit of the sticky substance that also sometimes comes with older ashen drake dolls um, but usually if you just wash the parts in uh, Dawn and just kind of scrub the parts really well, it gets rid of that oil resi oily residue that for some reason uh, does that. And then I don't, no, again, no issues after that. So yay, I'm hopeful for this one. She did come with this cute little outfit. This is by, oh, it's by child of mine. This must be a like much older uh, child of mine outfit because I have never, ever, ever seen this. So it's a little jacket. 
and I guess that top came with it maybe and then this little onesie look it's all ruffled it is used because there's like some yellow staining here but it's still really cute <laughs> so there's that and then little pants here and it says bunny hugs that's so cute I like that little outfit I'm gonna keep it I'm gonna keep it and put it on my babies because it's adorable even though it's got some staining it actually feels really nice too all right well very cute so this is Miss Katie I'm not sure at this time if I'm going to be uh, re reborning her belly for a belly plate as well. Her belly's so hard. It's such it's so hard to you hear it. Like it's just hard as a rock. <laughs> so sometimes it's not worth. I might just get the limbs out and be done. But anyway, guys, thanks very much for watching, and you will see hopefully some progress of Katie in the near future. We're gonna get her reborn. Um, my thought is actually to reborn her for the doll show next summer. I know that's a long way away, but I already have some like dolls planned that I'm working on starting now and saving them until uh, they get um, displayed and sold so on at the doll show. Anyway, guys, um, we will see you in another video very, very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for watching. If you like what you saw, maybe take a second to hit the subscribe button. If you want to, that is. No pressure. But if you decide to do so, there's also a bell notification right next to that subscribe button. You can't miss it. That way you will always get notified every time I upload a video. Again, that's also extremely optional. No pressure. But we have fun here, so it can't hurt, right? Ha ha ha. Courtney out.